Google Classroom is where your child's work will be placed to access online and will allow students to open assignments, ask questions, and turn in assignments in one centralized location from anywhere. Before signing into Google Classroom, the student may need to sign into their Google account using their student username and password. Each student is given a unique username that uses a combination of last and first name letters with a standard suffix. Their password should be WCPS plus their student ID with no spaces and lower case. This password is case sensitive and should be in lower case only. Students can only access Google Classroom through their WCPS Google account and must be signed in. Within the Chrome browser on both the iPad or Chromebook, you can check to see they are signed in by looking in the top right hand corner and clicking the circle that either has an image or initials. This will show you the username. The student can go to Google Classroom on the Chromebook by typing classroom.google.com or they can go to the iPad and click on the app. Once in Google Classroom, there may already be a class that asks them to join. By clicking the Join button, you will be automatically added into the course. If there is not a box with a Join button, Click on the plus sign and add the unique code that has been assigned. This will allow the classroom to be accessed. Parents have the ability to go into their child's Google Classroom when they use their child's login information on any device. Yet parents and guardians will also receive an email inviting them as a guardian to receive email notifications. When you receive this email, you will accept the invitation and choose the frequency of the emails from daily to weekly. Anytime a teacher adds materials to the Google Classroom, this will be added to your notification. Depending upon what you choose, you will receive an email listing the assignment for the particular day or week. This will occur for each Google Classroom that your child is enrolled in for the school year. If you do not receive an email, please notify your child's teacher. In the next video, you will learn how to navigate Google Classroom and how all teachers will arrange their classrooms.